Did you have fun? Yeah! yeah. That's the first time when I did athletics and I didn't know it was. And it was really fun. Go Puppy! Go Puppy! I'd love it if they continue doing it because it's just been amazing. It's just been awesome, hasn't it? Yeah. You had so much fun. <laughs> I tried and then I missed to hit it. Then I tried again and then I hit it. Um, when the coaching finishes, we usually go to our car and get a ball so we could play. And we spend a long time after we finish the session playing in the playground. <laughs> we learn lots of different things. It's not just about running around with the run object. Like I said, most importantly, it's about socializing, it's about mental, it's about physical. There's kids that come to us here with bad attitudes, so we don't just ignore that, we try to teach them some of those social behavior that will go a long way in shaping them into better people. Should I do parkour? Absolutely. Yeah. Why? It's fun. It's fun. fun. Drop your body down, put the hand down, and you push and slide. From the start, where they're being really shy and quiet, and then starting to open up, um, you know, starting to sing songs randomly in the middle of the class. <laughs> You know, it's it's great to see that happen. Even parents, they have made new friends and, and I've noticed uh, one group, they told me that they even went out to like a tour or something, they went somewhere else together with all the kids in that group. So it was, it was really good. Mara's confidence has increased a lot since coming to Zumba, which is amazing. What are we doing in the holidays with April? A disco. We found out about the disco through April. This is our fifth month here, so our first time to Australia actually. Oh, yeah, so it? these uh, sessions are really, really good. So we get to know locals. We have the chance to experience the lifestyle here. And the boys, I guess, have met friends. Them. Yes, friends. They, yeah, they know them by names. <laughs> they had a great time out here. So they're smiling all the time, and it's really great. It's really great. So we really appreciate. It's not just the kids that are having fun. The parents having fun, they meeting with the new uh, family and especially for the new arrival to our community. They don't have a friend, so they come and meet with the, with the other parents here and they become a friend. So we have a multicultural group and Australia all about multiculture, so that's another good thing. It's just a fantastic initiative from the council. I mean, it's amazing. Yeah, we get a lot of people who use this as uh, their first time playing a sport. Through this program, we uh, get about 15 kids sponsored to Start Line Club. So that's a, a blessing uh, for uh, the community here and for those kids that they missing out. Once they finish tennis lessons, they can go yeah. straight into playground over there with their friends, maybe new friends they just met. And yeah, yeah it's, it's really good. Yeah, we just want to thank the coach, thank the Marine Council for giving um, our kids this opportunity, which is a big deal for us here. Yeah. Everyone plays together. Just become a bigger, like kind of like a family. After the first week, yeah, the boys were really ecstatic. Get them to sit at the edge of their comfort zone and just consider going outside of it sometimes. See, you see, this is what I mean. <laughs> the things that you learn, it's for life. It's not just for today. And you know, the rain didn't stop anyone. That just says how much they're loving this. We usually, after this, we go and have lunch together. It gets us out of the house early. And yeah, it is really, really nice, actually. Yeah, it gives me an opportunity. I've always wanted to be a tennis player. You meet some new people, you have friends come over, all sorts of different things. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, they're all just here to have a bit of fun, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we can actually chat for a change. <laughs> got a lovely lady who's got four children. I've learned about a different culture, I've learned about another person's plight to live in Australia and where they go to school and what languages they learn and it was great, yeah.